Hi, my name's Eric Reamer. I'm at the Cleveland Clinic, and I'm happy to be here with Dr. Michael Corwin from UC Davis. He's the lead author of our newly published multicenter study assessing incidental adrenal nodules in patients without known malignancy. Mike, what unanswered questions were addressed in this study? Well, we noticed that adrenal washout CT is commonly used to assess adrenal incidentalomas, uh, but that the bulk of the studies assessing the performance of washout CT were not performed in the incidental population and felt that this needed further investigation. So this study was performed at six institutions and assessed washout in 299 patients. It was organized by the Society of Abdominal Radiology Disease Focus Panel on Adrenal Neoplasms. The adrenal nodules are stratified to those that were smaller than four centimeters and another group that were equal to or greater than four centimeters. So what was found? Well, similar to other studies assessing incidentalomas, the overall malignancy rate was quite low at 1.4%. However, we did find that for nodules greater than or equal to four centimeters, the rate of malignancy was 21%. So that seems in line with other studies. How then did washout perform compared to the earlier published literature? Well, the results were not quite as robust. So for differentiating benign nodules from malignant nodules and pheochromocytomas, absolute washout of greater than or equal to 60% had a sensitivity of 78%, specificity of only 70%, with a positive predictive value of 98.8%, and a negative predictive value of 9%. So that's certainly a step down from the sensitivity of 87% and specificity over 90% of earlier studies. Do you think that incidental pheochromocytomas that washed out more than 60% hurt the specificity? Yes, one third of pheochromocytomas washed out in our study, similar to multiple prior studies. Furthermore, about one fourth of benign lesions did not wash out, reducing sensitivity. So then is washout useful in the incidentaloma population? Unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be that useful. So among incidental adrenal nodules less than four centimeters, the prevalence of malignancy was not statistically significantly different between those with washout at 0% and those without washout at only 1.3%. So then in what scenario do you think washout is still useful? I think washout is still useful in patients who have a known malignancy and an adrenal nodule as non-hypervascular metastases should not demonstrate washout. Uh, Thank you everyone for listening to the highlights of our study. We hope you will read the entire manuscript and you will think critically about the role of washout in adrenal incidentalomas. Thank you.